What's up guys, JTM Offroad here. Today's video, that just happened. All right, you guys, so it's going on long enough. I'm finally gonna tell you what we're gonna do to the Avalanche. Why we've got this one with four tens, which I'm sure probably of you, probably some of you could probably piece things together, but because I've been in touch with Rough Country, we have you know talked a little more about some things, and I threw around the idea of maybe getting a six inch lift for the Avalanche. They said sure. They they donated me a six inch lift. For my avalanche <laughs> I just I guys I don't know like <laughs> it's just amazing like they've been so supportive of, of my channel and they have worked with me so well and I'm just I'm just blown away I I'm blown away that they, they're they're so awesome so you know they're they're donating me this lift they're where I'm gonna make some videos out of it um, you know installing it on here and I hope you guys are excited. This is going to be great. It's not It's not a leveling kit. It's not like a two inch lift kit. It's a six inch lift. Six inch lift for this. Like, <laughs> this is going to be, this is going to be one tall tow rig. So not only are we going to do that, we're going to go, we're going to get 35s on it. Eventually we're going to do different stuff with the bumpers and you know, things like that. You know, I'm going to be replacing panels on here and there's going to be some body work involved. And we'll have to paint this eventually. So I'm, I'm thinking Monster Liner. I'm thinking maybe we go with Monster Liner. If you guys don't know much about them, it's truck bed liner that's UV resistant. And it's also color tinted. So I gotta figure out a color for this. Um, why don't you guys drop some, some ideas down below. You know, the, the black looks good. You know, once I, I don't think I wanna paint the cladding cause I think it'll just, the color's gonna be too bold. So I think if, you know, there's all this gray on here, I have to, I have to, you know, do the restoration stuff on, on these pieces because they're so faded. I think this is probably going to be more of the original color once we get those taken care of. So, you know, the black looks good. I've been thinking about a tan for this maybe. Those are more of the colors I'm leaning towards. I don't want to do anything too extravagant. You know, I still have to drive my vehicle to things for work so i don't want to seem you know just too off the top when i go places so you know this thing's gonna be lifted up pretty high you know after the six inch lift 35 inch tires you know it's gonna be sitting up there that's gonna be you know i don't know nine maybe ten inches higher after everything so i don't i don't want to be too crazy with it so tr try to keep a Try to keep a color that's a little more, you know, toned down. Um, I thought about orange, but if I did orange, I'd have to do like a, I don't know, like a, like a darker orange, nothing too bright. So let me know what you think of the project. Uh, very anxious to see how this thing tows. I've noticed driving, I can tell it has four tens compared to the 373s in my truck. I'm interested to see what it's, what it's going to be like when it's going to be you know, it's gonna have 35s on it, so four tenths should hopefully help with that a little bit, and then we'll see what it's like towing. So this thing, uh, well, not this one, but my other one, wasn't the best at towing. So <laughs> what what better thing to do than uh, go ahead and lift it and put bigger tires on it, right? It's my daily driver pretty much, and I entertain the thought of you know taking that off road. So I think that would be very fun. The other thing is if I did a nice paint job on this. I'd never want to take it off-road because I'd, you know, be scared of scratches and stuff. So if we went ahead and did some bed liner on this, I wouldn't feel so bad about getting scratches and stuff. Plus, it would look good. You know, I'd like to get different bumpers for this. So if you have any ideas of bumpers, I kind of want to go with like a pre-runner bumper up front or something off-road-ish. The, the avalanches, they're too rounded in the front. I just don't know what it is about them. Whenever they're lifted, they just, they look a little odd. So it definitely needs a different front bumper. Um, we'll go with something different in the rear too. 
and you know anything else that you might think would look good on this so guys let me know what you think about this I, i'm really excited i hope you guys are so if this is the first time to the channel please be sure to subscribe we got a lot of good videos coming up of this if you like the video please give it a thumbs up go down to the description for t-shirt sales buy yourself t-shirt help out the channel and i'd say that's it for this video guys we'll see you in the next one mm -hmm.